everyone it is today is saturday august 16th right yeah um and we are doing a vlog for you guys today it's me and mike Say hello. Hey. mike's driving I am. um and we are i'm gonna put this up as a sunday fun day vlog i know it's not actually sunday but i mean i put it up on sunday and it sound you know it's better you guys can watch it on sunday i feel like a lot of people like to watch things on sunday so anyway um we're running around right now. Um, we have to stop at a few places and I'm gonna try to do this thing where I don't tell you what we're doing next because I feel like that ruins the surprise. So yeah, so we're running some errands and then our big thing today is that we're actually, and I'll tell you this, is we're going into the city um, to spend like an afternoon in the city and like get lunch and we're going to visit our old neighborhood um, and the city being Philadelphia, in case you didn't know, in Pennsylvania, because there's more than one. Um, yeah, so we're going into the city, and yeah, we're gonna have lunch. We're running some errands before we head over there. Um, but yeah, hopefully it'll be a good time. Hopefully my car doesn't get towed. Um, we're really hoping against that. I think we're gonna try to park in a parking lot as long, because we know where there's one where we used to park our car in our old, when we used to live down in the city um so yeah we're gonna be going there eventually but there we're doing something else in the city first and i'll, I'll i want to keep it a surprise so right now we're heading over to the post office because i've got a package back there i think you can see it that i need to return some items i ordered um one of them didn't wasn't right i think they sent me the wrong color so i'm sending it back so i just wanted to do that before we head off um so yeah, that's what we're doing today. And of course you get to follow along. Okay, so we left the post office and we're now at our second destination for the day before we head into the city. We are at the bank. Mike had to run to the bank um, to get some cash or whatever. So he's in the bank and I'm just chilling here. You can see our box is gone. So yep, I'm really excited. We're gonna go into the city next. Um, hopefully do a little bit of shopping like a little bit of shopping just a little itty bitty bit of shopping um and then get lunch i know where we're getting lunch which gets me really excited i think the reason we're going into the city is specifically to get lunch at this one place um because i'll be honest like you know i don't really think that the city has like the best food in the world like I don't think that there's there are a lot of good restaurants down there but it's not like I feel like going into the city all the time to like oh I really want to have dinner at this place or that place but there's one thing that I miss from living in the city um and we're gonna have lunch there today and you will see it don't you worry you'll be so excited I hope you're ex as excited as I am so yeah I'm just waiting here for Mike to get back out of the bank so I'll let you guys go for now and the next time you see me we'll probably be at our first city destination which is exciting okay so we're in our first destination um mike's with me yep we're home. and uh yeah we're home basically we found this really lovely couch um let's give you a little tour around here what look at this lovely glassware yeah you guys if you couldn't tell we're in ikea but literally this couch that I'm on is like the best couch I've ever seen in my entire life. It's like my favorite color. Let me show it to you guys. Ah. <sighs> Look at it. It's so pretty. I'm vlogging in Ikea. I feel like it's like a rite of passage. So yeah, we're not here to look at, at um, couches or anything. We have to pick up a few things now. Um, a new lamp, because our old lamp is breaking and we like it so much we need to get another one. Or at least I like it so much, Mike doesn't like it so much, but you know, whatever, I don't care. Um, and then I have to pick up a few other things, so yeah, maybe we'll let you follow us around. That was an awesome couch. Okay, so we're back in the car and so are all of our items, if you could see back there. I'm sorry, we really couldn't show you. It was really like a cluster in there. And then, of course, when you're leaving, it's, like, insane to get a spot in one of those, like, drop-off pickup places. Um, but we basically got a lamp. I got some boxes for my Expedit, um, like, bookshelf. Um, and I got um, a, a desk pad that I'm doing a DIY with, so stay tuned for the DIY. That'll be next month. That's going to be coming in September. 
Um, we got something else, right? Oh, that box. Then I got like a box to go under my desk. Um, and it's like on casters, so I can roll it in and out, which should be really good because the box that I have under there right now is like huge and it does not roll. And um, yeah, so because it doesn't roll, I don't use it so often. So I'm hoping this will be like a really good under my desk storage solution to replace the one box I have already down there. Um, yeah, so now we're headed over to Society Hill in Philadelphia where we used to live and we're gonna be going to get some lunch first probably after we park because it's 1.30 and I have not had anything to eat or drink all day. No joke. Um, so I'm really hungry. Mike ate a little bit of breakfast this morning but I kind of slept in so I didn't get breakfast. <laughs> so yeah, you will see what our amazing lunch is going to be and I hope you guys are as excited as I am. So we'll see you in a few. So I thought I'd film a little bit here um, because there's some historic buildings. This is the Betsy Ross house. Not a really great angle here, I'm sorry. But we're driving through like the heart of Society Hill. It's so beautiful. I thought I would just show you guys. Okay, so fun fact, this thing in front of us here, there's a building, oh my God, the, sorry, the roads are really cobbly. So you see that building in front of us um, with like the cupola, the white cupola? That's called Head House Square. And it's just like a tunnel um, sort of a thing, like kind of like a pavilion. And it's actually where Mike proposed to me. Do you remember that, Mike? I was there. And Mike was there, he remembers. So there's usually like little things going on. It looks like there's a little fair or something going on here. Farmer's market. Farmer's market? Could be. There's a, usually on the weekends, there was like a fair or farmer's market here. You can see all the buildings are like brick and beautiful. That's the bank. So I just thought I'd show you guys because it's really lovely here. Very pretty. Nola, that was a restaurant. Yeah, yeah, they're doing like no, they're doing like the craft fair thing that they always have. Well, what should I try to park? Uh, try to park in over here on the parking lot. In the parking lot. In the parking lot. Wait. You guys, we're gonna go because we're going in this parking lot. See ya. Okay, we parked. Now we're on foot, and we're like basically in the middle of the head of the house square right now. There's a little fountain going. We're just driving, walking around, driving, walking around. How does it feel to be back here, Mike? Old, back. old stomping grounds. Old stomping grounds, I know. Fuck. We lived here for a while, like literally like a block away. Maybe we'll pass where we used to live. Yeah, fun um, But we are headed down. We are on, where are we like, this is 2nd Street? 2nd and between. We're in 2nd and, and, and South. Yes, we're headed to South Street. Party Street. Party place. Yeah. Okay, let's see. Right, you're looking at South Street, it's right in front of us. Where? Oh yeah, the diner! Oh my god, we were talking about the diner the other day. Yeah. See that diner over there, you guys? I don't know if I'm like holding it steady enough. It's South Street Diner. Like if Mike and I used to always eat there. That's not the place we're going to eat right now though. If I could get my zooming properly, properly done here. Okay, you guys, you can see it now. So we're at the corner of, was this third? Yep. Third and South. And there's music playing, but whatevs. Look at the cigar shop! Anyway, this is where we're going for lunch. I don't know if you guys can see it. We're going to Lorenzo's. It's like probably one of the best, I, I think it's like the best pizza I've ever had in my entire life. Um, but it's apparently rated like one of the top 100 pizza places, like in the US. Um, and it's really awesome. You'll see why it's so good in a second as soon as we can cross the street. Here we go. We can go. <laughs> what? 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 Do you always get a piece? No. I'm confused. Okay, let's go in. What? 
Okay, so we got our pizza. Um, and now this guy's performing. So we're heading over to kind of where we used to live, yep. and we're gonna go to like the park and eat because there was really no place to eat over there. So, oh my God, remember this place? Oh, yeah. Fish kebabs. Oh my God, I used to make like pick it up for me all the time. They had one of the best cheesesteaks. Best cheesesteaks. Oh yeah, they did have a really good cheesesteak. Pats and Gino's. Nah. Even over here, there's Jim's, and Love Jim's has a line out the door, like usual. Oh my god. This is like a really famous cheesesteak place, but Mike and I never liked it. It was really sad. Oh wait, over here. What's this one? Hold on. We'll just turn on this way. Jim's sakes, the, the bread was bad. Yeah, the bread was weird yeah. at Jim's, so. Yeah, we're really now going towards where we used to live. Still so live like a block away. Yeah, this is our Starbucks here. The trash can, so it's all like said. Each year, wins your way. Boutique. Remember that uh, juice shop that was there? No. Okay, so we found a place to sit down that's really close to where we used to live, and we're gonna sit and eat. Ooh. Helicopter. Okay, so we're gonna show you what we got. Now, you guys remember, we got two pieces of pizza. That's it. Open. And they are, do you see these, you guys? Look how big, look how big compared to my hand. These are huge. These are like twice the size of like a normal piece of pizza. Mike, tell them the story of what happened when we first went to Lorenzo's. When we first came to the city, one of the first things that we did was we decided, hey, let's get a piece of pizza, you know, you know, pie for, you know, first night in. So I ordered a pie and they said, okay, it'd be like $20. I'm like, that's a little high. I go in there, Alexis was at home. I go in, I come back with two boxes of pizza. Alexis is like, why'd you get two? I'm like, it's not two, it's one. Because they, there's not they're, enough They're room. so big. They're, their pieces are so big that they have to put them in like more than one box. Um, so yeah, it's just humongous. And it's delicious. And that would be why it was $20 for an entire pizza pie. And we had no clue when we went there. We just like literally were like, let's look for pizza places that are well rated around us. And that was the one. So, yep, now we're going to eat this gigantic pizza. I'm so excited. I've been waiting forever. Okay, so we just finished eating and it was delicious. And now we're just gonna walk around and I've got my digital camera with me and I wanna take some really pretty like shots in the city since we're in like such, such like a historic neighborhood. So we're just gonna walk around, take pictures and Michael occasionally film, okay? So we'll see ya. They filmed National Treasure here. Remember that? Nicholas Cage was running from Sean Bean. I think it was Sean Bean. Yeah, it was through one of these cemeteries. It might have been this one or the one on the other side. But yeah, good movie. Okay guys, uh, it's me, Mike. I'm taking over the camera now. Alexis is far ahead. She's taking photographs of everything. So it's just gonna be you and me, Mike Cam, for the next couple minutes. Let's do this. Okay, so we're heading now to this place that we kind of found by accident. We lived next to, <laughs> this place is like literally like two blocks away from where we lived for like a year. And we never noticed it. And like one day just randomly strolling around, like we happened to come into this serene park that's just away from everything. And it's just a really beautiful place. And now Alexis is just taking pictures everywhere. But look, you can see behind me. It's just a nice, beautiful path no noise the houses here are like incredible and then up ahead i'll show you guys there's like a kids park and okay nearly Sorry, fell. My, i just cut him off <laughs> i cut mike off <laughs> see that alexis nearly pushed me on camera like look at this building look at these This is the middle of Philadelphia. You wouldn't even know it. Quite nice, quiet suburb. Check this guy out. 
some crazy art piece. Again, it's in that park that I was just rambling on about. Look how crazy that thing is. Okay, you guys, you guys know that I like to take over Alexis's comment section. So leave a comment below. What do you think this is? What do you think it means? <laughs> See, this is what I love about Philadelphia. You got that there. Historical site. So, I mean, who knows what this was for? This could have been a place where, I don't know, people who wrote the Constitution then. Not the Constitution, it's the Declaration of Independence. Did they write the Constitution? There's Alexis far away. She's off taking photos. This is, it's beautiful here. Whoa. Check that out. Look at that, random little mural of art. It's glass, too. I love that about Philly. It's just like randomly, it would be like, okay, boom, artwork, right in your face. Five and a half. That's weird. Where did Alexis go? Let's go find her. So it's taking us a while to walk down one street because every like 10 feet, Alexis stops, like stops me, like and goes, oh! We have to take a photo of that because she's noticing. She's noticing like the most small details, but she's taking like really, really great pictures. I hope she, Alexis, what? you got to put these photos up anywhere. Put, put them up on your blog. Go check out her blog because she's got to put her photos up there. She will now because I said it on camera. And she can't. Go, she can't go back on it because I mean, yeah. <laughs> See. Spider's web. Does anyone else see that? Oh, let me zoom in. It's actually a spider. Slow zoom in. Can I even see that? Okay. Whoa, do you see it though? I do. Having fun? Yeah, I'm having fun. Cool. There's a pineapple. Hey, alright. See? See, what did I tell you? She notices the smallest details. <laughs> All right. Check this out. There's another pineapple on this road. There must be a meaning behind that. I don't think that two random people just really like pineapples enough to hang them up. I'm gonna have to Google that. I just landed on me. He just landed on me and now he's just not leaving. Go little guy. He wants to be on camera. <laughs> so we're back here kind of in the center of Society Hill. And this is kind of sad. Right there, that's the... Well, it's now, it's, it's now a vacant building. It used to be a restaurant called the Artful Dodger. And that is the place where I took Alexis right before I proposed to her. Like over in this general direction. Yeah, and it's actually right next to where I proposed, but we went out to dinner there, and then we walked over here. Let's show you guys kind of in this little tunnel guy. Came through here, and yeah, look how beautiful it is. Look at the lights. And yeah, about halfway down, I proposed. It was kind of creepy because after I said, will you marry me, like one of the lights like right above us like flickered on and off. So I thought that was creepy. Lux didn't, but... What, the flickering lights? Yeah, the light kind of flickered on and off. <laughs> Very ominous. <laughs> but yeah, this is where it happened. I'm sad, I'm sad that that restaurant's gone, but oh well. Hi. Okay, now Mike's in bed. We just got home, and I guess it's nap time because he immediately came home and like threw off all his clothes and went to bed. So I covered him with this. So you guys, I know like Mike likes to get his pants off normally in these vlogs. <laughs> it's his favorite thing to do. But mm -hmm. now he's gonna take a nap, right. and I think I'm gonna take a nap too. I really wanna upload. I really wanna. I think I'm gonna upload the photos to my from the 
city in, onto my computer first, though, because I want to look at them because they look so pretty on the preview. Cool. Awesome. Yeah, so that's what I'm going to do right now, people. Um, sorry, my hands in the way. Yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and break my computer out and upload some pictures. And I'll probably take a nap, <laughs> too, because Mike's going to take a nap. I'm going to take a nap, too, even though I've only been up for, like, five or six hours at this point. It's kind of pathetic, but what are you going to do? So I'll see you in a few. Okay, so um, I'm in my office right now. I'm, like, sitting on the floor in my office, and Mike and I didn't take a nap. We just kind of, like, watched some YouTube videos and stuff for a little bit because I just could not fall asleep, and I guess neither could he after I woke him up pretty much. So, um, right now I decided that I was just going to go ahead and start working on organizing my office because it's a freaking mess, if you can tell. Um, it's crazy. I'm like, I'm constantly in a state of like reorganizing it. Um, and I know I've been asked before to do like, um, like a home tour and like an office tour or whatnot. I do have an office tour from like three years ago when we first moved into this place where my office looks like perfect and like there basically was nothing in it um, because we had just moved from a very, very tiny apartment to this apartment, which was much bigger. So we had a lot more room. And in three years, I proceeded to fill it up with stuff. Um, and so right now, like storage is like one of our big issues in the apartment and I just feel like, um, like organizationally, I feel like we have enough room. It's just that I don't have things organized in a way that like makes the most sense. Um, like just think thinking it off the top of my head, like I know that like my, uh, like my office supplies slash like, um, like planner supplies, like stationary stuff, like craft stuff is like. I can, like, I know it's in, like, one, two, three, like, they're at le in at least five different places. Like, I should put it all together in, like, one place. Um, so I am going to do that. So right now, I'm just going to go ahead and put together these boxes. We got these big boxes. Um, let me see if I can show you. Uh, ah, falling. Okay, so we got these boxes. They're called cassette, and they're these giant boxes. They're I don't know, 13 by 15 by 11 and a half, or three quarters. These are the right ones. Hopefully we bought the right ones. Um, the, they're supposed to fit into the boxes in my Expedit. So, um, but now I'm looking at it and I'm like, oh, you know what? I think they're supposed to go like long ways. Um, so yeah, so I'm going to build some of these. I got two packages of them and there's two in each pack. So we've got four of them. And then this thing here, you can see, is this like rolly box that I want to like replace that box and perhaps that box um, under my desk. And it's rolly so then I can actually move it as opposed to like that thing that just sits there and like cannot actually be moved. Um, so yeah, so I'm going to work on that stuff right now and I will catch up with you guys in a few. Okay, everyone, so some hours have passed. <laughs> I'm really sorry about that. Um, we were, I well, I was organizing my office, and so now it's like, let me see if I can show you. Oh, this is my desk. Mm, it's slightly more organized. You can't actually tell. That was a horrible, that was a horrible view for you guys. Um, but, but yeah, so um, I organized my office. I took a little bit of a shower. Um... And Mike and I just went to the grocery store to buy groceries. So we just got home and unpacked those. And mm, the microwave just went off. And I'm making spaghetti squash again. Let's go check the spaghetti squash. Let's go check it. Sorry, hold on. This is actually a better view over here to show you guys. I'm sorry. This is actually a better view over here to show you guys. Um... Then I did some organizing down here, and down here, and back there. But I still have stuff everywhere. Okay, so it's time for a very late dinner and some TV. It's like, is it 8 o'clock? It is, yeah, 8.12. Okay, it's 8.12. Um, and this one I'm having for dinner. 
It's more spaghetti squash, a gigantic helping of it. I, we went to the store, grocery store, and we got four more of those um, mini squashes. This one wasn't like the super small one that I made, I think, in my my video about spaghetti squash that I will link below. <laughs> it was a What I Ate Wednesday. But look, I have it on my pretty plate because I like eating it on my pretty plate. It makes me happy. But this is like a whew, delicious amount of serving. I, don't, I think this is probably too much for me to eat, but it's okay. It's just spaghetti squash. It's not going to kill me. And Mike has some leftover pasta. Um, what do you have, like baked ziti? Mike's got like baked ziti. You don't need to see what Mike's eating. It's just baked ziti. So, yeah, that'll be it for me probably for tonight. Okay, so this is the point where all of my clips ran out um, after this point when I had dinner. I think the only other thing I did was had a cup of tea and we watched some shows on TV. Little Mermaid was playing, which was really exciting. Um, and then we went to bed. I kind of feel like this video was very little bit disjointed with like the whole going to the city and then it like abruptly stopped. So sorry about that. Um, I think I thought that Mike was taking control of the vlog from then on because I was way too preoccupied um, <laughs> taking photos. But I did go ahead and insert some photos along the way so you guys could see those. So I hope that you enjoy those pictures. And of course, like Mike said, go follow my blog because you will see those pictures make their way um, onto my blog in the upcoming days and weeks and such. Um, but I think I gave you a couple of nice ones in here. So I hope you enjoy those. And of course, make sure to click on that latest video uh, so you guys can see uh, my previous video. And of course, subscribe if you're not already subscribed so you can see more awesome videos by me. So have a great day, guys, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.